In today's video, we're gonna get the Lumpini Lizards to pick the winner of our 300,000 subscriber flight giveaway. This guy's huge. I don't know how I'm gonna convince him to pick our winner, but I got an idea. So here's the deal. Every time I hit a new 100 subscriber milestone, I give one of you a flight to Bangkok from wherever in the world you live. And if you're one of my loyal Thai subscribers, well, then I just give you 50,000 baht cash. So by the end of this video, we're gonna pick a big winner, but we do things unconventionally here at Retired Working For You. So I'm in Lumpini Park. We're gonna see if we can get the lizards to pick a winner. But first, Adam's gonna pick the three finalists. So we have all of these comments loaded into a randomizer here. And all I have to do to pick our three finalists is this start button. So are we ready to rock? Yeah, hit that button. Finalist number one, boom, is... Oh, finalist number one, Paul Youngs. All right, Paul Youngs, you are contestant number one. Okay, time to pick another uh, finalist. Finalist number two. I'm gonna click start, boom. Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Cats loft, cats loft, cats loft. You got a chance to win a flight from wherever the hell you live, cats, to right here in Bangkok. Time for number three. Boom. Who is it? Who we got? We got Richard Christensen. You are contestant number three. And I actually see a lizard swimming right over there, but how the hell do we get the lizard to decide the winner? Well, oh, I remember what we did with the rats. He's looking, he's sizing up his cheeses. Which cheese will he take? He's coming in, he's coming in, he's sniffing. I think this is gonna happen. Oh my God, he takes the sharp and bitey cheddar. Oh my God. So I think we can do it with the lizards. I'm not quite sure we want to get him over there swimming under the bridge to pick our grand winner. There's only one way that I can think of to make that guy pick a winner. And that is to buy some lizard food. Let's see what, oh my God. Right away, we got some fish flopping around. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that uh, a fresh whole fish is good for the lizards. So uh, contestant number one, this is what you're gonna get. We don't need no 100 baht fish, maybe a oh, 20 baht. Can I get this one? One? Jesus, did he just put a fish in his rubber boots? He wants to cut it up for me. He doesn't know that we're feeding it to the lizards. So, so it's okay, just like this, just put it, just bag it up. The lizards don't need it scaled. The lizards don't need it filleted, sir. Oh, and it's okay. Just tomb. No, 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 no. This is for the lizard. Tomb? They just couldn't wrap their heads around the fact that uh, we didn't need anything done to this bad boy. Okay, right there in the bag, contestant number one. You're the fish. Ooh. Man, smells like high school. Cup, cook, and cap. Okay, all set. Let's go find contestant number two. Oh, maybe some of these. I think that the lizards are gonna like these giant prawns. Ani song? No, not kilo, not kilo. Nung? Song. Yes. Hog sip. Okay, 60 baht worth of prawns. Contestant number two, you are all set. We got mussels. Oh, a crab might be good. No, I think we need to get away from the seafood. We need a bit of variety in our lives. Oh, geez. Look at that. Okay, I got an idea here. So let's see, look at all this meat. Oh, this is the guy I'm looking for. Uh, I need Taurai crab. Oh, one kilo. Nung kilo, that's it, huh? Okay, let's get a bunch of chicken feet. Ani, samsip. Uh, I was gonna get a whole chicken, but that wouldn't be fair because we only got a couple of prawns. We only got one little fish. So we're going with some chicken feet for contestant number three. Sipaba. Chicken feet are a good deal. We're talking 15 baht here. 
Okay, so we got our lizard food. Now it's time for the lizards to pick a winner. Okay, I'm back, ma'am. Look, I got the shit. You got it? Yeah, yeah, All right. I got it. Okay, so contestant number one, Paul Youngs. Paul, you get the floppy fish. So here's what we're gonna do. We're in the arena of play here and we're gonna lay out all three of our contestants, pieces of bait, and when the players hit the field, whichever one they eat first is the grand prize winner. Paul Young, there you are. Oh, these are pokey, Ket's Loft. Contestant number two, you got the prawns. Let's just lay these down beside each other. And contestant number three, you got the chicken feet here. Richard Christensen, if the lizards like the chicken feet, well, then you're gonna win yourself a flight to Bangkok. Now, we've set the stage. The field is ready. All we have to do is wait for our all-stars to arrive. Good day, folks. Jim Doppelganger here, back in the studio. And I gotta say, I'm excited to be back here in the main stadium, Lumpini, where the action is always heart-stopping. Huh. And it looks like the, uh, the action's already getting underway. You can see the flies already congregating on the disgusting bait. And beyond that, the riverbed from where we expect a lizard to emerge. Right away, some all-stars are lurking. We have large Lonnie, three-time world champion, stalking the dirty water. You can see the insane stats that he has logged to this point in what is sure to be a Hall of Fame career. His sense of smell is legendary and you wonder if he's gonna take an early run at yet another title. But wait, not too far away, newcomer Leon Lutt appears up for the challenge. Leon Lutt stormed onto the scene this year with impressive stats. Three rotten fish heads, five dead rats, and he's the only player with a live chicken kill this season. We're in for a treat here, folks, and Lonnie starts things off with his signature submarine move. Let's look at that again. His form is immaculate, and when he dives like this, we know where he's headed. But what's this? Leon is already up on the shore and appears to be sneaking slowly but surely towards the goal. He's coming closer, showing us the same stealth moves that landed him that live check-in earlier this season. We have Lonnie moving in the water. Leon on the land. The excitement is bringing the fans out of their seats. But wait, the damn crows are invading the fields. The officials need to do something about this. Ah, excuse me. No outsiders on the field of play. Get away. It looks like this is spooked, Lonnie, but Leon Lutt has taken advantage. He's now in striking distance from our bait. In a surprise move, he's not coming in from the water, and he's going to get to the chicken feet first. Will he take them or move past them to the prawns or irresistible aroma of the rotting fish? He's smelling the chicken feet, but he must actually eat one to win the contest, and oh my, he's eating it. If he, a smaller rookie and star on the rise, can get it down his throat, we will have a new champion, and yes, He's done it! He's done it! The rookie has burst onto the scene and taken down the old champion in a historic victory. Oh my god, he's taken a chicken foot. It looks like we have our winner. Richard, thanks to all-star Leon Lutt the Lizard, you have won a flight from wherever you live to this great city of Bangkok. I suspect you'll be wanting to come and pay Leon a visit. We had crows coming in trying to disrupt play, but it was Leon Lutt who would not be denied, ladies and gentlemen. The excitement here in our arena today has been mind-blowing. So as Leon is gonna hit the showers, I uh, want to let you know, Richard, that to contact us, you email connect at retired working for you. We will drop a comment under your comment, and uh, you got to see it to claim your prize, Richard. But you've just won a flight to Bangkok. The lizards of Lumpini never disappoint. And for everyone else, we're going to do this again at 400,000 subscribers. We're already at 320. I don't know what, what we should do when we get to 400,000. We got to do this all again. I don't know. If you guys have uh, any ideas, <laughs> let us know. And when you yeah, good, you yeah drop a comment. And if you have an idea what we should do to give away the 400,000 subscriber flight, who the hell should we feed this shit to to decide then? Comment below, and if you haven't subscribed, subscribe, and you'll be eligible to win the next 400K flight giveaway.